Um, I appreciate all you guys' support so far. It's been it's been amazing. Um, a lot more than what I expected. I'll tell you that. Uh, so today I'm actually recording this it is Mother's Day, so what uh, May 12th right now, and as y'all heard me say, I was in a podcast. Um, yeah, I messed up there. I thought I was recording, but apparently I wasn't. And uh, so, if you want to know my story on how I got this pretty badass bionic arm, um, well, a little bit of my story. Uh, I'm going to link, I'm going to have the two uh, links for that podcast in the description below um, when I post this video. Uh, but I just wanted to get on because you know, I'm trying to incorporate mental health and stuff along with, you know, my car and everything else. So my rec, the anniversary is this Tuesday, May 14th. Be seven years already. Um, can't believe it, you know? Um, so... And y'all know May is Mental Health Awareness Month. And I'm not one that believes in, I don't believe in coincidences. I believe that, you know, everything happens as it should, when it should, how it should, and how it's supposed to. And, uh, you know, again, like I'm here because, you know, I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing right now. And that is telling my story and following, you know, pursuing my dreams as well as helping others along the way. And, uh, you know, so a lot of this stemmed from, actually it did stem from mental health and I mean, bad mistakes, but again, stimulated from, I wasn't right up here and, uh, don't want to see anybody else go through all the stuff I've gone through. Um, yeah. So, hey, I came this far, you know, it's been seven years, I ain't giving up now. You know, I'm just getting started, and I got a long way to go. And shout out to uh, Kentucky Ballistics, as long as you know Kentucky Ballistics on YouTube, you gotta check him out too, and uh, I think this shirt is very fitting for, you know, everything, my life. Like, and he, you gotta hear his story, he's been through... He almost died too, and that's why he got this, one of his reasons, but what's your excuse? You know, what is your excuse? And is it really that, like what you're going through, is it, I mean, I'm here, okay? Well, don't make excuses, because you, you'll never get anywhere. And, uh... Like you'll hear my podcast, um, I don't do well with excuses. Um, I'm, I'm sure I've said it before in some other videos, but um, I appreciate y'all listening to the uh, to the podcast. Uh, it's called the Diner Podcast. To some guys I used to go to school with, uh, that I went to school with, um, they got a real good thing going on for our community and just a lot of good. Um, I think they're gonna go far. They're eventually they're gonna get into YouTube and stuff like that. And you know, I'm real proud of what they're doing. I think it's really awesome. And you know, I was pretty humbled to be a part of just part of it. You know, they were allowed me to come on, tell my story, and I will warn you, I do say fuck in their locks. I was trying to beat a record from another buddy's, but I didn't do it. Um, but appreciate it if y'all take a listen. Uh, you know, kind of summarizes up a little bit. I'm going to be on again and talk about it some more and might sit down and do it one day on here a little bit more. Um, sorry, I'm saying home a lot. Uh, you know, just got to find something that you're passionate about and that'll help. That'll help keep you, keep you going. And... Especially like this car, you know, I'm very, very, very passionate about this car. 
and getting it done along as my you know my brothers do. It's it's hard. But I'm just being real with y'all, you know. Now I'm sure you'll see me crying here sometime. Like I said, ain't nothing wrong crying. Like it is okay to cry. Just get that shit out. It don't matter. Get it out. Talk to somebody. Please. You're not alone. And you never will be alone. No matter how much you tell yourself that you are. You know, I'm here for you. Reach out to me. Um, I'm going to do a little slideshow. Some pictures of, you know, my truck that I wrecked. And, uh, I'll say listen to that podcast and you'll hear just kind of a little bit what I've been through. And where my problem started. And what I did to get to where I'm at today. Um, so I'm going to end it off here. I'm going to start getting that together. I want to have this video out. It'll come out Tuesday, um, the anniversary of my accident. And, uh, I appreciate everybody, really. Your support has been awesome. You know, like I said in the beginning of this, you know, it's been awesome. Yeah, I love y'all. And, uh, I'm going to do my best to keep on you know, getting better at all this, and like I said, I still got some big plans coming up soon. Uh, yeah. All right, that's all I got. So uh, I'll put in some pictures of my accident, uh, some other just other ones of getting prosthetics, uh, some just my healing and. That's pretty gnarly, nasty pictures, but then I don't want to get my video demonetized, and that would suck. So, hope you all enjoy my story, and I uh, hope you all have enjoyed what I put out so far. Um, again, I can't do it without you guys, so your support is everything to me, and, you know, still can't believe I'm doing this, man. That's awesome. But hey, anybody out there, if you're ever scared to go after your dreams, just, you know, don't worry about what anybody else has to say. Just go for it, okay? Just go for it. Damn, it's, you know, I'm so, I'm, I'm glad I did. And being on camera ain't nothing to me now, and I don't care what, you know. I like it. Like, I love doing this. So, like I said, find something you guys are passionate about, and just, doesn't matter what it is. If it makes you happy, you do it. And if you find yourself in a hard place, like I said, just reach out to somebody. You know, I'm always here for you. And, uh, I want to... Alright, I think I'm done with this one. I'll enter some... Got any questions, you know, comment down below on some stuff if I, uh... If I didn't cover it or if you got some any other questions on just like how my how my prosthetic works and uh uh kind of like what more about my accident if you want to know um yeah that's really about all I gotta say right now I just wanted to make this short video it's been seven years of my accident I'm five years without alcohol I'm three years almost four years without tobacco and I've never felt this good and wait till you hear about everything I've been through and you'd be like, you know, I still got the ability to smile and so can you. So, appreciate you.